Hello, everyone, and welcome to Fearless Fridays. My name is Dr. Benjamin Ritter. I'm a leadership and career coach that guides leaders to be the leader of their own career. So if you are stuck, if you are ready to connect with a coach to find and create a career that is fulfilling, if you've tried a bunch of things, it's just not working out. We have solutions. We have proven strategies. We provide leadership coaching that puts your career first to help you create a career that you can love. So today I actually want to talk a little bit about conflict, more along the lines of blame, this feeling of blame, feeling that you are being blamed or you are blaming others for something. You see this a lot when we play the victim or we're in an argument and we actually feel like the other person is at fault. Now reflect back on a time where you felt attacked, you felt blamed. That hurt. It felt like you were actually just being unfairly treated and targeted. But the person that was blaming you, when you feel blame, when you feel pain from that, is also feeling pain themselves. This is a really good rhyme. Just remember, when there is blame, there is pain. And so if someone is blaming you, there is pain behind that. There is something actually going on that you need to uncover to solve the conflict. But all too often, people get blamed and then they attack. And what we really need to do is get blamed and go, okay, what's going on? I hear you. You sound really angry. Can you tell me more about what you feel? And that can be really hard because we feel like someone is blaming us for something unfairly. Or maybe you even feel guilty about what they're blaming you for. But ultimately, if someone is blaming you for something, they're in pain. And if you want to solve that conflict, the best thing you can do is explore it. So I hope you take this to a conflict that maybe you have in your life or use it in the future. It rhymes, so it's easily easier to remember. And if you do actually try this, send me a message. Let me know. I want to hear how it goes because I care about you living more for yourself.